All right, blasting the music right now so I could do this intro. Yo, what's good, baby? Today, we gotta download Assetto Corsa, but with Content Manager, because that's the better launcher where you can run the servers to, you know, drive around with your friends like this. Drive cars like that one. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I was gonna do it. <laughs> or this one. Jesus Christ, Alden. <laughs> get over the truck. <laughs> All right, let's get it. Boys are gonna be on in like any second, so we gotta get Content Manager downloaded, a set of course to downloaded, and we're gonna run it. We're gonna run it. Let's go. All right, here you are on your home screen. This is actually my home screen. What we're gonna do, we're gonna go to Steam. Gotta go to Steam, dude. All right, so you're in the store. You guys wanna you guys wanna set up Assetto Corsa, right? That's what you wanna do? All right, you got Assetto Corsa. Make sure it's this one and not the Competizione one. Just get this one, go here to Ultimate Edition. Honestly, you could get away with the first one and just play no DLC servers. That's not as fun, bro. Spend your money, man. What are you saving for? You're not going to college. I already have it, clearly, but I deleted it for you guys so we can actually do this. So you're going to install a set of course up. Make sure you pick exactly where you want it to go. Discovering some files. Let it run, bro. All right, it's done. Assetto Corsa, here it is. It's ready. Launch it up once because you need it to uh, make a root folder. Let it launch. Here we go. Double, double, doubles. Double, double, doubles, bro. Just double clicking. Who cares? English. Duh. Main menu. Leave it alone. Goodbye. Thank you. See you later. See you later. The fuck out of my lobby. All right. Now that a set of course of the main game is installed, you're going to want to go to Google. You want to download Content Manager. Right here. Content Manager. Click the first link if it's Google. I think Bing shows up with some other random stuff. Right here, who cares? It looks amazing. Wow. Woo, you can do that. Cool. Download. Right here. It's going to pop up bottom left if you're using Chrome. So this opens. What you're going to want to do is extract this to wherever, whatever drive you want it on. So I'm going to put it on my games drive. Extract there. Replace the files. There it is. You can close out of that. Double click on Content Manager. Close out of this. It's going to pop up. It's going to automatically find where your root folder is. If it doesn't, you can change it. And to find Assetto Corsa, here's a little trick. Click here, go to your library, go to Assetto Corsa. Right click right here, you see this? It's like right under me, right here, dude. Look, that's actually pretty sick. All right, we're gonna go to properties, go to local files here, hit browse. It'll take you exactly to where your Assetto Corsa is. All you have to do, copy paste this into here. What's your name? Yay, dude. All right, add a shortcut, obviously. We're gonna want it. Uh, 7-zip, yep, we want 7-zip. CF Sharp, yep, we want CF Sharp. Those two installed, dope, we don't want anything else. It's just, you know, we're trying to play the game. We need what we need and we want it to look great. All right, sick. Now we have this open, get rid of that, dude. Focus on this window. What are you doing open? Get out of here, bro. All right, disable, we don't need that. So this is where you're gonna start. It opens up right away. If you see a little green arrow, click it, update it. Keep it up to date, bro. I'm out of breath. Talking so fast, bro. All right, the first thing you want to do, this is the main window that opens up. If you want my graphic settings that you see when I'm streaming in that corner, uh, bell notifications on if you want to know when I stream. But yeah, when I'm streaming, you can see if you like it. I go for the super realistic graphic settings for Assetto Corsa. I love it. I think this game looks amazing and it performs great. I'm getting over 100 frames in like any map. Smaller the map, more frames. I'm getting like 300 on most maps. Yeah, PC build link in description too if you want to check that out. But here. I'm going to put this in the description too. I actually have on my Discord right here. Right here is my Discord. If you go to my vids channel in my Discord, link in description, I uploaded this guy's graphic settings. Great video, by the way. This guy, this guy's straight up great video. He did, he did great. But you go straight into the description of the video. So what you want is these five links. All you got to do, middle mouse click on each of them and minimize that. You see how it's showing up there? Save and apply for all of them. Save and apply for all of them. If that does, if they don't pop up for you, then what you can do is go up here to what you just opened. 
you hit add video preset, it's gonna open in your content manager. That's all you gotta do. But I already, th those are already updated. Uh, we can close out of that completely. Now you're gonna have my settings, which are also that guy's settings, so credit to that guy, but I actually tweaked them a little bit. All right, so first thing we're gonna do is go into settings, and you're gonna wanna change some things around. So it's gonna take you to content manager first. You don't need to do anything in here. You can mess around with the appearance and all that, and like your content, this is all like your preference. This is like what you, what you wanna do. So if we go over to uh, language and region, re, blah, 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 language and regional, change it to wherever you are. I'm Fahrenheit. Use Imperial. Use 12. It's just simple, bro. It's just like all these preferences are your preferences. We're going to need the other CF Sharp now that it shows up in the plugins channel. Make sure you get that. Quick switches. No. Replays. Sure. And you can mess with that too, boys. Go to the next tab right here. Assetto Corsa. Go to view and UI. Show virtual mirror on and show the driver's names, unless if you want like a nice clean look. I'm gonna go for the clean look tonight because you know, we're doing a bunch of drifting at my stream. Make sure your bell notifications are on and you're subscribed. Thank you. Here, you're probably gonna wanna mess with your uh, audio settings, but I'll show you an easier way to do it in game. Controls, all right, whatever you're using, I'm using a wheel It's on the ground. I'm gonna make a separate video on how to set this up. I'm not doing it now because we're just trying to play right now, you know, depends on whatever you want. So I'm gonna click off this video, go to the next video, go to the next video. Marketing, bro, get on that. All right, custom shaders patch, third, third tab right here, install. It's installing, click this one, the latest version up top here under available versions. Updated successfully. Nice. All right, next what we're gonna do, we're gonna go down to weather effects. So here, what we're gonna do, we need something called Soul 2.2. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into Google Chrome or whatever the heck you guys use. Better not be Bing, dude, I swear to God. Search up Soul 2.2. It's gonna be the first first link, race department. And then right here, the mega link. Looks sketchy AF, but I wanna play the game, dude. Who cares? Click it, drag it, drop it. Right here, click install. It's gonna take a second, done, remove completed. Click this, if it doesn't show up, restart your game. All you have to do is, uh, oh, it's gone. Okay, type it in, cause I'm stupid. Down here, I highly recommend it if you love this game, like me, into taskbar. All right, here, controller script. If it's still not there, what we're gonna do, you have to open up theme, properties, local files, browse. Close that, close that. Here's my local files. Here it is here. Set a course and make sure that's what it looks like. Open up a second file explorer. What we're gonna do for soul, and double click it. It's gonna pop open with this window. Look at how many windows, bro. Crazy. Open, open, click, hold shift, click down to description. Make sure you don't grab that one. And then now what we're gonna do, we're gonna make sure that we have the Assetto Corsa folder right here. Cause we're gonna go over here, click, hold shift, click. Don't click that one. Only up to this one. Drop it. Open area on the Assetto Corsa folder. Nice. Go away. Go away. Go away. Open content manager. It's not there, but it's here. Close it. Dude, if you ever have any bugs in this game, like a car is missing or anything, just reopen it. It's not that hard. Click. Make sure it's on Soul 2.2. This one just goes to Soul. Nice. That's all you have to do. All right. What do you guys want to do? You guys, you guys want to go drive? You want to go drive? All right. So click drive right here and drive. I'm going to put it right here. Full screen right here. Nah, it's actually stupid, Tom. All right. We got the game here. We're going to have to click drive. Then you go down here to online. Look at all these servers, bro. Too many, bro. All right. Look at this. So here, if you want to go on that Tokyo downtown, you know, with all the lights and the highways, it's called S H U T O K O. Click says nothing to display you need to show the servers that are that are actually missing the content that you need so what we're gonna do we're gonna go down here to ping sort by so you have you know the closest it's always better to have better ping you know what i mean so right here here's a nice one utoko srp us east dense traffic yeah weather and rain teleports whole lot of cars so what we're gonna do because we're missing a lot of stuff, boys and girls. What I like to do is favorite it because I know that, you know, it's going to be dope. Go over here to the top left on favorites. Click. Missing. Here it is. It's just going to be here. So since we're missing all of this stuff, I don't know why it's a bug. It doesn't. It's usually going to show up right here. Join their Discord. Yep. It launched. Close that. So now we're in the AOE boys, like it says here, for the server. AOE boys Discord server. Scroll down until you see it's SRP. SRP. Scroll all the way up. We got to download the track. Download the track. Download. Download it anyway, bro. I'm just trying to race my cars. All right, it downloaded. I got to go into my downloads folder because here it is. SRP main. Click it. Drag it. Drop it. 
onto the content manager you can see right up here there's one installing click it it's searching for the content shouldn't be too hard to find bro i just gave it to you <laughs> all right here we go look at all this stuff install it all right that's installed nice now the track is gone because we installed it now we just have to download all these cars and all of this traffic you see all the traffic that's all we're missing is cars and traffic bro cars and traffic isn't that the same thing tom that's what I said. All right, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna go back to their Discord. We're gonna go back to SRP. Now we need the car pack, and we need the traffic pack. It's that simple, boys and girls. Download it. Download it anyway, bro. Two minutes. All right, go back to Discord. Download the traffic one at the same time, because you got good internet. If you don't, sucks, bro. <laughs> Upgrade that shit. All right, download the next one, which is the traffic pack. Jack. And I'll show you another cool trick. Make that a little bit smaller. Close this. Traffic pack's done. Click and drag right from there. Drop it right on there. Oh, you boys are gonna... You're gonna love this game. I love this game, bro. All right, one second. Let's go. Come on. Zero seconds. Click, drag, drop. Look at... I told you. Found some stuff, bro. And look at how it's disappearing because there's gonna be less errors when we're all done. I bet. Traffic's done. Now we just need the cars I wanna drive, bro. I just wanna drive some cars, man. Oh, okay, there it is. God, that was like so long. All right, installing. Look at all the cars that are going away. Amazing. All right, let's let that install and look at cars in the meantime. Ooh, look at, you could drive a stance. Where'd it go? You can drive stanced BMW on bags making 431 brake horsepower, 550 newton meters of torque. What else we got here? We got a McLaren P1. Oh, it's loading in, dude. I just want to see it. Look at this 911, though. Give me the 911. Look at that thing. 500 horsepower. Dang, dude. Look at that. 1,000 horsepower. What did I just see? Wide body X6M making 1,000 horsepower. Bro, I might try in that. Oh, they have a Hellcat. They have a Hellcat. Look at it. 1200 newton meters of torque 947 brake horsepower yeesh gapplebees gapplebees m4 the new body you guys are gonna love this game just let it download bro trust all right which one are we gonna pick to show off come on probably the first one that we picked right yeah let's just let's just do the beamer bro do the beamer man all right all right right here all this should show up it should give you some stats on what car you're driving. All this should be loading. If it's not, restart your game and double check all the steps that we took to get this game installed and set up within, dude, 20 minutes. 20 minutes and you're in. All right, this is the screen that you guys should see. Right here, all this. But you don't have to do anything with it. You know why? Because all you have to do is click drive. That's all you have to do. Click drive. But I'm going to give you guys a couple things. Move your cursor all the way to the side of the screen up here top right all the apps all of these apps see all these apps this is going to block it because you're in the pits right now but i recommend doing audio just at first mess with what you want your sounds to be yep mess with what you want it to be pick your speakers set the driver and go back all the way right click all apps click off of audio i recommend having the chat up because a lot of the chat you can vote for weather and stuff i'm going to put it right around here and what's another thing that you can do? Uh, click off essentials. I don't like the essentials one. I like this one, the gears. Just straight up make it a little bigger. Click the arrows here and then pin it so it doesn't move. Uh, you can put your pedals. I like showing my pedals because, you know, people want to see what you're stepping on. Come on, make it bigger, bro. That's the biggest it can go. All right, I had to put my stream overlay on so I know how to set this up. Another thing that I recommend as far as your apps, I would put um, uh, the track map, obviously. Get the track map. I would put it right around up here. Uh, pin it in with the pedals, pin those. Uh, go back here. There's another one that I want you guys to do. It's tires. It's gonna help you check on your tires. Somewhere there, done. Look at that. You're set up to roll. You also have the rear view mirror and you're ready to go. I don't know how to set it up on keyboard. My my wheel is currently being built on a stand, so I think we're ready to go. All right, my dog's trying to leave my room, and I got to do an outro. So uh, thanks for watching. I hope all of this made it really fast and easy to set up and get into any server that you want. Remember, just follow the discords for links. Check out my discord. I always post cool servers. I'm always streaming. Subscribe. Um, I probably forgot something that I wanted to say, but whatever. Peace.